We did have a medical emergency in the back scene with one of our graduates that we're working with right now. And we're also allowing some of our parents to make their way through the entry gates. We'll be running about 10 minutes behind. Thank you for your patience.
we can please make our way to our seats. We're going to be beginning in three minutes. our 2024-2025 Honor Guard.
please welcome our dignitaries led by Cajon High School principal, Dr. Tina Bishop. Please welcome Cajon High School staff, led by Vice Principal Ms. Rochelle Moss. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please make some noise for the class of 2023 Cajon High School graduates. Thank you. 
Please welcome to the stage ASB President Zoe Campbell. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the presentation of colors by Cajon School Color Guard. Please remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance followed by the National Anthem. Please, 
Place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the singing of the national anthem. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose bright stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight o'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets red glare, the bombs bursting in air. It proved through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say does that star-spangled banner yet for this retreat of colors. You may all be seated. Ladies and gentlemen, amazing staff, proud parents, and the exceptional graduating class of 2023, make some noise. It is an immense honor for me to stand before you today as the ASB president and address this momentous occasion of our graduation. We have reached the end of years of hard work and perseverance and personal growth. Today, we gather here to celebrate not our individual achievements, but the collective spirit that has propelled us forward as a graduating class. First and foremost, I want to extend my heartfelt congratulations to all of you in the audience. We have overcome countless challenges, obstacles on our journey through high school. From late night studying for exams to balancing extracurricular activities and personal commitments, we have demonstrated personal responsibility, respect, integrity, and determination and engagement towards our goals. However, let us not forget the support system that has been instrumental to our success. To our dedicated teachers and mentors, thank you for your guidance, encouragement, and belief in our potential. You have taught us new knowledge and skills that go far beyond the classroom, empowering us to face the complexities of the world with confidence. To our families and friends, your love and unwavering support have been the pillars of strength throughout this long journey. Thank you for being here today. Your sacrifices and encouragement have filled our ambition and propelled us toward greatness. We are forever grateful. As we stand on the threshold of this new chapter of our lives, we must acknowledge that the world we are about to enter is ever-changing and dynamic. But let us not be daunted by these challenges. Instead, let us embrace them as opportunities for growth and positive change. Graduates, each one of us possesses a unique set of talents, passions, and perspectives that can shape the world in profound ways. As we venture into the unknown, let us remember to power our own voices and the impact we can have as individuals, as a collective. Our diversity is our strength and our willingness to listen, learn, and engage with one another will shape our future we aspire to create. 
let us remember the values that have guided us thus far, our pride motto, personal responsibility, respect, integrity, determination, and engagement. These five words have been up in our classrooms and around the halls. We must continue to show our cowboy pride wherever we go to help guide us to success. As we go forth from this graduation ceremony, let us not forget the importance of continued growth and learning. Life is a journey of continuous discovery and every experience, whether it be a triumph or a setback, provides an opportunity for personal growth or professional development. Embrace new challenges, take risks, and never stop seeking knowledge. Remember that success is not measured solely by external achievements, but also by the impact we have on the lives around us. Finally, as we bid farewell to our beloved alma mater, <laughs> let us carry the spirit of this remarkable institution wherever we go. Cherish those memories we have made, the friendships you have formed, and the lessons you have learned. These bonds have formed here, we formed here are irreplaceable and the connections we've made will serve as a foundation for a lifetime of success and fulfillment. Class of 2023, as we stand on the threshold of an exciting future, let us embrace the challenges that lie ahead. Shine bright like a diamond, have the time of your life, and don't stop believing. Congratulations once again. May our past be filled with joy, purpose, and boundless opportunities. And as Hannah Montana once said, life's what you make it, so let's make it rock. Thank you. Please welcome to the podium, Cajon High School principal, Dr. Tina Bishop. Good morning and welcome distinguished guests, staff members, parents, and most importantly, the awesome graduating class of 2023. My name is Tina Bishop and I am the principal of Cajon High School. Thank you for being here today as we celebrate our graduates. Today marks the culmination of years of hard work and dedication for our students who and those who have supported them during their journey. Joining us today to commemorate our graduates, our County Supervisor, Joe Baca, Jr. <laughs> City Councilman, Damon Alexander. <laughs> Board President, Dr. Scott Wyatt. <laughs> Board Member, Mickey Chahusky. <laughs> Assistant Superintendent, oh, no. Superintendent Mauricio Ariano. <laughs> Both are. Assistant Superintendent Anna Applegate. <laughs> PJ. And Assistant Superintendent Dr. Marcus Funches. <laughs> we are honored to have you with us this morning. I would now like to invite Dr. Scott Wyatt, to share words of inspiration and wisdom to the class of 2023. Well, thank you, Dr. Bishop. What an amazing day it is today in cowboy country. So I wanna welcome all of our cowboy family, friends, special guests, students, and staff. Just a few years ago, I remember this special day because I got to celebrate it twice with my son and daughter. Our home is a cowboy home. I remember how proud I was as a dad. And I know our family members out there, our staff and all of us are proud of you, our amazing seniors. But I also remember it being this incredible celebration. So we're gonna start off today celebrating. I'm gonna have to ask some participation here, and I want you to give it your cowboy all and cowgirl all when you do it. But we're gonna start with family and friends out there. And our family and friends, I know you've brought those noise devices, those horns, those whistles, and on the count of three, 
I want you to stop, yell, scream, and show these kids how proud we are of, of all of them. So get ready. One, two, three. Hey, I love it. I love it. Awesome job. I see Samuel. I see Matt. I see Devin. I see uh, who we got out there. I see all these signs of kids out there. So I love it, parents and family. Thank you so much for celebrating them. Students, I don't know. That was pretty good. But what do you think? Can you do better? All right, let's stand up. I want you to turn around and on the count of three, we're going to thank all your family and friends that are here today that supported you. All right, don't let me down. One, two, three. I love it. You guys are giving me tears of joy, man. I'm reliving that moment as a dad right now, proud dad, and uh, I hope you all feel that as well out there. We also have to say a very, very special thank you to all of our San Diego City Unified School District staff that have been here along the way and along the journey for our students for the last 13 years, some 14 years. So let's give it up for our staff from San Diego City Unified School District as well and say thank you. You know, Dr. Bishop uh, said two words that I wanted to talk about this morning when she uh, had her little introduction, and that's hard work and dedication. Hard work and dedication. So on behalf of the Board of Education, I want to share with you our thoughts on the two pillars of hard work and dedication. Some of you may be very familiar with one of the greatest boxing champions ever, Floyd Mayweather Jr. He is the highest earning boxer in the history of boxing. Earned over a billion dollars so far, so far. But he has two words when he trains in the gym that they don't chant, they shout when he trains. And I know that's what it's taken for you to get here. He'll say, hard work, his team says, dedication. And throughout the time he's training, he says hard work and they said dedication. So I'm going to ask all of us now to participate in this and to set our mind for the years to come for all of you. So I'm going to say hard work, and I expect you to say dedication. So this is a group activity now, all right? Group activity. And we'll do it three times. Third time has to be the best, all right? Hard work! Hard work! Hard work! That's what I'm talking about. Wow! I love it, folks. I love it. You know, um, hard work has carried you this far, and I can assure you it's going to carry you through your life. The dedication is you not giving up on your goals. You have not done that. You achieved that today, but you have many more goals to come. So keep working hard and keep dedicating to your plan and execute on that plan. I'm going to end on another person you may know, Dwayne Johnson. Us old folks know him as The Rock, La Roca. And somebody once asked him, they said, Dwayne, what's the key to success? And he said, there is no key. You need to be the hungriest, humble, and hardest working person in the room. That is success. So congratulations, class of 2023. We love you, we're proud of you, and may God bless you all. Thank you.
I'd now like to invite uh, County Supervisor Joe Baca Jr. to come share some words. Thank you. Good morning, good morning, cowboys and cowgirls. Make some noise. Good morning, really it's a pleasure and honor to be here and say a few words of encouragement. And it's very special to me because for those of you who don't know, I was a public school teacher and uh, coach for 12 years. And education is very, very important to me personally. So to be here is very, very special. I was actually recruited to coach at Cajon High School to be the softball coach, but they couldn't find a job for me. So I could have been a cowboy. Could have been a cowboy, but more importantly, I'm here today to support you and show that the County of San Bernardino is in much support of you. But not just the County of San Bernardino, you got many parents. Hearing the applause, hearing everybody cheer, seeing the signs out there, that is your support system. And that's important. And I really want to thank the ASB president. She gave an amazing speech. Give it for the ASB president. That was an amazing speech. If you listen to the words she said, she said a lot of things that are very, very inspirational. A lot of life lessons were said in the words she had to say, so take those words to heart. A lot of people in your life are gonna give you words of encouragement. And she talked about life lessons, learning. You can learn from a lot of people. I'm 53 years of age and a county supervisor, and I don't have all the answers. I don't know it all. We all have the ability to learn. We can take a little bit from each person. We can find out who we are. We are who we are. We're all independent. We're all individuals. We're going to find out our strengths, our weaknesses. Don't just focus on your strengths. There's certain things you're all good at. Try to work on your weaknesses. Get better. Improve. As she talked about, she talked about personal growth. We're all trying to personally grow because every time you grow, you become a better person. You become more marketable as an employee and you have more success. And there's many ways to measure success. You can't count the money in the bank account. That's not the most important thing. We all want to take care of our families. I think generational wealth is important. That doesn't mean handing millions of dollars. That means putting your family in position to succeed as you move on, because we're all going to have our time. I won't be supervisor forever. One of you could take my place here, and I hope you do. And I think you can because you're very, very capable. You're a Cajon Cowboy, Cajon Cowboy. You're from the San Bernardino community and Ca San Bernardino community, we're very, very proud of you. And Cajon has a long history of success. Academics, athletics, professionalism, people going on and doing great things. You look at, you know, the famous WNBA player, Laisha Clarendon, right here from San Bernardino in the WNBA today. You look at Charles Johnson, played for the Pittsburgh Steelers, right here from San Bernardino. You will be one of the next greats. You will create the new chapter in your life. And we're all going to have our own chapters. We're all going to have our own books. And the title of our books are going to have our own title. You have to find that path. You have to find your career path. And I'm very, very proud of you, each and every one of you. You look great out there. Your parents are cheering for you. That's important. Today is a special night, and today is your night. You know, hopefully tonight you have a good time. You get to celebrate with your families because, yeah, he's celebrating. All right, give it up for that guy. He's celebrating. Give it up for him. Celebrating. Absolutely. But I'd like to give a special shout out to a couple people that I personally know. I want to congratulate Valerie Bogard and her son, Malachi Morris Bogard, graduating today. Congratulations, Malachi. Your mom is proud of you. And your mom sent me a personal message to let me know how proud she is of you and how much she loves you. Where's he at? All right, Malachi, keep smiling. All right, Malachi, Malachi, I stand corrected. I stand to learn too, right? I make mistakes. The other person I wanna give a shout out to, she was all CIF as a junior, I'm very, very proud of her. Had a great success in softball. Let's give it up for Mercedes Alba. Mercedes, where are you at? Great career. Congratulations to you, Mercedes. And a personal friend of mine, Tim Prince, who's out in the audience. I'm very, very proud of him. He's a successful attorney from San Bernardino. But his son's graduating today. That's important. He's here to support his son. Let's give it up for Justin Prince. Justin Prince, congratulations. So I'm... So on behalf of the County of San Bernardino, 
We're very, very proud of you. God bless you. Class of 2023. Please welcome to the stage Cajon Choir with the musical offering Man in the Mirror.
Big round of applause. The home choir led by teacher, Mr. Matthew Thomas. And now we want to recognize special students here at Cajon High School, our salutatorians and valedictorians. When I call your name, please stand and wave. Our salutatorians, Mackenzie Cervantes, Tyler Deering, Gina Murphy, Isabel Romo, Adam Schultz, and Vanessa Zaragoza. And our valedictorians for this year are Yusuf Antur, <laughs> Ramsey Duary, <laughs> Samantha Penaloza Cabrera, <laughs> and Riley Snyder. And if you can direct your attention to the screen for a special message from your valedictorians and salutatorians. Good morning, parents and fellow graduates. Today marks an important occasion in our lives as we gather to celebrate our achievements and bid farewell to the halls that have shaped us today. It is with great honor that we stand before you all as Valley Victorians and Salutatorians of the class of 2023. Looking back on the journey that led us here, we can't help but reminisce about the challenges we overcame, the friendships we made, and the countless memories we created together. Our time in this institution has been nothing short of transformative, both academically and personally. Today, we stand as, we stand as a testament to our perseverance, dedication, and unwavering belief in our abilities. I think I speak for most of us when I say the experiences and memories we've had at Cone often extended beyond the classroom. For me, I spent four years trying to perfect my time management skills. There were days when I bounced back and forth between cross-country practice and the ASB room. There were nights when I was here helping Miss Wu and the rest of the ASB team set up rallies and dances till midnight. Then I would rush home to get a lab done for Mr. Lindsay. I was lucky to be in bed by 2 a.m. And let's not forget zero period. TOK at 6.30 a.m., especially after nights like these, were tough. Like many of you, my motivation faded. I came to rely on my discipline and my integrity. Those of us who elected to play sports for Cajon learned the real meaning of integrity outside of the classroom. Our coaches not only taught us what it meant to have integrity in the sports we played, they also modeled it to us. We knew we had a responsibility to conduct ourselves in an honorable way both on and off the field and court. We were educated in the rules and regulations governing our sport. Rather than make excuses as to why we lost a game, we were taught to focus on the aspects of the game that we can control like our own performance and question ourselves on how we could have done better. We were taught to respect our teammates, our opponents, and our officials. We were taught to play tough, but also to play fair. Brene Brown once said, integrity is choosing courage over comfort, choosing what is right over what is fun, fast or easy, and choosing to practice our values rather than simply professing them. We have all faced situations when we had to choose to be courageous rather than be a follower. We have all encountered instances when we had to choose to do the right thing rather than take the shortcut or the easy way out. And most importantly, moving into this next chapter of our lives, we must choose to practice our values through our actions, not just our words. I am grateful to my parents who have raised me to take action and stand up for what I believe in. I am fortunate to have acquired life lessons and skills from teachers and counselors like Mr. Lindsay, Ms. Wu, and Ms. Pimento. The home has prepared us all for the next chapter in our lives. Stay courageous, choose what is right, and always practice the values that have been instilled in you. I would like to thank those that supported me on this journey, and I would like to thank those that doubted me on it. I define success as making my parents proud because they're the ones that I owe it to. Words cannot explain how grateful I am to have my mom and my dad. The look on their faces when I read my acceptance letter to Stanford, Columbia, and USC was priceless, and it's moments like those that keep me going. I'm proud to say that I'm a first-generation college student because I hold the honor of being the first in my family to make it this far, and I only plan to go up from here. I guess one piece of advice I'd like to share with this class today is to not let others determine what success is to you. 
Not everyone here will be attending a four-year university, so maybe your idea of success is starting a family. Others' idea of success might be wealth. I can't speak for everyone here, but I think everyone's end goal in life should be happiness. So surround yourself with people in life who are going to make you happy and not drag you down. I know we gather here today to celebrate the end of our long 13 years of school, but life doesn't stop after high school. I wish the best for everyone here, and once again, congratulations, class of 2023. Todos desde los partidos de fútbol y las manifestaciones hasta las alarmas contra diseños que constantemente suenan. Cajón ha sido nuestro lugar compartido por los últimos cuatro años. Sin embargo, la clase de 2023 ha atravesado muchos obstáculos. Desde que nuestro primer año se acortó hasta el segundo año de aprendizaje a distancia. De distancia, sin embargo, hemos mantenido la frente en alto, Hemos trabajado duro y ahora marcamos el fin de un capítulo importante en nuestras vidas, el comienzo de uno nuevo. Todos estaríamos orgullosos uno de nosotros en nuestro próximo capítulo que embarcamos, sea lo que sea que consista. Quién sabe, es posible que estés sentado junto de una futura doctora, un futuro abogado o un actor de primera línea. Ahora, el camino aquí no ha sido fácil. Especially starting out with our freshman year being cut short and you always have the trials and tribulations of distance learning. The goals and aspirations that we had set for ourselves were put on hold, and yet we managed to push through with our heads held high. The obstacles that we had overcome during this time have changed us in many ways, whether that be good or bad. And ever since we come back, it has just seen that time has just flown right by us. Those old goals and aspirations that we had set for ourselves were changed, and that's okay. This just means that the goals that we set and make for ourselves aren't set in stone, meaning that they're always up for change. Take what you have learned these past four years, whether that be in the classroom or not, and make goals for yourself to help keep you pushing forward. And if there's one thing I've learned about goals is that it's important to make long-term ones. However, that doesn't mean you need to burn yourself out in order to achieve your goals. It's important to find a balance between working hard towards your goals and taking care of yourself too, so that your goals don't become something you resent. Of course, there's going to be times when you need to struggle and overcome hurdles in order to achieve your goals. However, it shouldn't feel like an uphill battle every day. So as we go out into the world to achieve our goals, remember that we need to take care of ourselves too. Remember now and in the future that no one knows you better than you know yourself. After four years of high school, we're all going our separate ways. And whatever it means for us, whether it be university, community college, taking gap years and more, know that you are choosing to do what is best for yourself. Not all paths are the same and they're not meant to be. Don't feel disappointed or discouraged if you're somewhere different than what you had expected four years ago. There is no one correct way to live life. You're going to have more setbacks and difficulties to overcome, but as long as you pursue what you're passionate about, you will end up where you're meant to be. You are not alone in this journey, and I know we all have amazing futures ahead of us. High schoolers' life is so much more than what we do in school, and we're only in school for a fraction of our lives. I know for a fact that in school, I've made some lifelong friends, and I've met some people that can't be found anywhere else. In the classroom, relationships that are formed are special because when we have similar goals and challenges, we're bound to come together. Friendships formed in the classroom and maintained throughout other aspects of life are very special. This is the time where we meet the people we'll know for the rest of our lives and where we we'll begin to mature and grow up together. As we begin to grow up separate ways, it is rough seeing these people grow farther apart from us, but I know that it is our individual plan to success. Although we may begin to separate from our friends as time goes on, there's nothing more inseparable than family. These are not only the people who observed us growing up all the way until now, but also the people who shaped who and where we are today. The bonds formed within family are the most important because they are the biggest source of motivation and affect our lives the most. In school, it is easy to be scared of the challenges that we face, and it is easy to back away from the challenges. Personally, when I've been faced with these challenges, I would have backed away too. But with the support of my family, the feeling of being scared from the challenges turned into confidence. And through my family, I realized that I should be gladly accepting challenges in our place. Of course, we must appreciate the combined efforts of the Cohen staff who helped define our high school experience. I know we all have our favorites. There are those who changed our outlooks, influenced our aspirations, and helped us improve. I would like to send a thank you to the teachers and counselors who spent countless hours dedicated to us students, to our principals, secretaries, and office staff who helped keep us organized and to our security, custodial, and maintenance teams who cultivated our academic environment. And also to all the Cajon staff 
who helped guide us through our four years of high school. Once again, thank you from the class of 2023. Oftentimes when we get really caught up in our day-to-day -day lives, as all of you have, considering the fact that you're here today, we can lose sight of what we do all of this for. And I can't lie, I've thought about it countless times. Why are we here? To what end does all of the work, all of the struggle amount to? It couldn't possibly be the tremendously small amount of time in which we are applauded during this day, no. And neither could it be some magical experience you should expect to have in the future. I believe the answer can be found somewhere in between the two, when you look back onto how we got to this point. And I can't tell you what it is, but maybe I could help bring you to it. A time where you would say your first and last words to some of your greatest mentors, our very own Cajon staff, who would guide you to achieving every goal you ever set. A time where you would play your first and last game with the team you felt was as close as family. A time where you would sit in class and hear your very first and last false fire alarm, followed up by all clear. And most of all, a time where you would meet the people you would have some of the most enriching, emotional, prideful, vulnerable, and laughable experiences with. All of you out here today, students, teachers, administrators, moms, dads, sisters, brothers, aunts, uncles, cousins, everyone, you all took part in an unforgettable experience for each and every one of the individuals you will see walk up here today. And you, the inspirers, the supporters, the sacrificers, the unconditional lovers, did so with something very special something that we, the class of 2023, the children of San Bernardino, and the pioneers of our ever-changing world will always pride ourselves with having for the rest of our lives. You did it with heart. And for that, we will always love you. Thank you and congratulations. All right, please welcome to the podium, our principal again, Dr. Tina Bishop. Okay. So graduates, do I have your permission to take about mm, four minutes to brag on you and share a few words? Just, just about four. Okay, great, thanks. All right, so I'm, um, you're all ears. Thank you, sir, thank you. It is with great pride and joy that I stand before you as the principal of Cajon High School to celebrate this class of 2023. I believe everyone would agree that this class deserves the celebration. This graduating class has shown determination and grit in achieving this momentous milestone. In fact, the class of 2023 has shown a strength that I don't believe I've seen in any other graduating class. You have persevered through school, societal, as well as personal challenges, leaving an indelible imprint on the Cajon community. We have students such as Esther Hernandez, who, who overcame challenges to complete high school in three years and will attend UC Santa Barbara. There's Christina Benjamin, who, who dealt with major health challenges that would take most people out, and yet she's graduating today with high honors and will be attending UCLA this fall. And there's Luis Garcia Garcia, who came to Cajon from El Salvador his junior year, knowing limited English, and yet he excelled academically and will attend college this um, excuse me, this fall. That's the strength of the class of 2023. Class of 2023, your strength has shown us all what it means to pursue success, to embrace diversity, and to push beyond our comfort zones. With great strength, the class of 2023 has challenged outdated societal norms, antiquated policy, and uninformed systems to create an environment that not only you, but those who come behind you can thrive. You have unapologetically advocated for change, refusing to fit into the mold that was created by tradition and status quo. Cajon is forever changed because of the strength of the class of 2023, and we thank you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> it is because of your strength that Cajon can brag about many different accomplishments. The class of 2023 has earned over a million dollars in scholarships, grants, GI bills, and other, other opportunities towards their post-secondary endeavors. We have 77 students who are candidates for the International Baccalaureate uh, Diploma. 
we have 151 California Seal of Biliteracy candidates. There are 203 Cowboys who have earned the Golden State Seal Merit Diploma. Our Cajon Solar Boat Racing Team led by Captain Damian Contreras. And with the skillful driving of Devin Vestal, defended our title in the highly competitive Inland Solar Boat Challenge and dominated our opponents. Senior, senior Ethan Etheridge was selected as the California Link Learning Alliance Student of the Year for his meaningful contributions to the link learning experience. Sierra Christensen. Krista Calvillo. Brenda Munoz Barra, our California Honor Thespians for their dedication and outstanding singing, acting, and technical work. In athletics, Philander Lee was named All League for three sports. Jaquan Smith was a master's qualifier in the 100 meter dash, running a 10.36. And Keely Embriani, along with Harmony Quiones, led our competitive cheer team to becoming the intermediate national champions. We have two National Speech and Debate Association Academic All-Americans. That's Isabel Amarillo and Evan Thompson. Additionally, Evan was named the National Speech and Debate Association Southern Cal Student of the Year. Now, these are only the highlights of the many accomplishments of the class of 2023. But as a result of your strength graduates, you have represented your school, your family, and your community well. There's a famous Mexican artist named Frida Kahlo, some of you may know. She once stated, al final del día podemos soportar más de lo que pensamos, meaning at the end of the day, we can endure much more than we think we can. Class of 2023, you have shown us all how true that statement is. In conclusion, I extend my warmest congratulations to the exceptional class of 2023. May you embrace the challenges seize the opportunities, and make a difference in the world around you. Remember the strength that got you to this point. Your potential is limitless, and I am confident you will continue to make us proud. Congratulations, and best of luck in all your future endeavors. Go class of 2023. And now the presentation of the class by Dr. Tina Bishop. This is the part you've been waiting for. <laughs> Dr. Scott Wyatt, it is my privilege and honor to certify that each of the graduates before you have met the criteria established by the San Bernardino City Unified School District Board of Education and the California Department of Education and do rightfully deserve the distinction as graduates with the receipt of the high school diploma. Now, I would like to formally present the class of 2023 for acceptance. It, it is our, our privilege and honor to verify that these graduates have completed all academic requirements established by the San Bernardino City Unified School District Board of Education and the California Department of Education and do rightfully deserve distinction as graduates with the receipt of their high school diplomas. On behalf of the San Bernardino City Unified School District, we accept you as, as graduates of, of Cajon High, High School! Woo! All right, graduates, it's about that time. If you could follow the lead of our Grand Marshals with the first row, please stand up.
This year, we would also like to acknowledge a fallen cowboy. If we take a moment of silence for Tyler Estrada. Thank you. Allison Smith. Rachel Stockton. Amanda Marash. Leslie Rizzo. Manuel Salas. Brian Escamilla. Moyo Soyo Oduntan. Mackenzie Brock. Brenda Munoz Barba. Julio Ortega. Adrian Rodriguez. David Iniguez. Elena Rios. Cameron Knox. Esther Hernandez. Alexis Barajas. Sarai Barrosio Ragosa. Kaylee Castillum. Brenda Cruz. James Perot. Nilissa Rodriguez. Jacob Vasquez. Aiden Isaias. Samantha Calva. Ashley Nieto Banduro. Soraya Silva Salas. Jashen Preet Kinda. Harsh Preet Man. Damon Adams. Michael Akoto, Zoe Campbell, Riley Snyder, Ramsey Duery, Gina Murphy, Tyler Deering. Adam Schulte. Yusuf Antour. Isabel Romo. Mackenzie Cervantes. Oh. Vanessa Zaragoza. Samantha Peñalosa Cabrera. Sinaí Pantoja. Sinaí. Aidy Miyamoto. Veronica Cervantes. David Perez. Raven Hill. Madison Gobi Breeden. Summer Hastings, Hillary Rosas, Maximiliano Sosa, Charles Arnold, 
James Luna. Isai Rivera. <laughs> Michael Whiteburn. Vicente Curos. Philander Lee. Malik Memphis Malone. Kaylee Hayes. Malachi Morris Beauregard. <laughs> Alyssa Jimenez. Ian Beauregard. Kylan Hayes. Devin Vestal. Chizateria Bakuru. Jimmy Reynolds. David Thompson. Mariah Beautiful Castillo. Giselle Garrett. Oswin Inge. Deshaun Bedeau. Jaden Jones. Caleb McNeil. Jaquan Florida Smith. Harmony Quinones. Deja Francis. Kaylee Satterwhite. Amaya Fulton. Amaya Newbine. Caleb Williams. Donovan Hyen. Noah Campbell. Steven Eddington. Raekwon Santiago. Jeremiah Angustine. Noah Scott Ball. Krista Lynn Calvillo. Cameron Williams. Jalen McFarland. Alex Kelly. Kyra Hampton. Janila Moreno. Nadia Hall. Lakia Mayfield. Samaje King. Charisma Berry. Linaya Macon. Jasmine Davis. Lawsonette Hudson. Zelena Henderson. Amaya Morrow. Isaiah Vara. 
Daniel Tamayo. Jacob Jimenez. Diego Sotelo. Brayden Austin. Demario Maron. Daniel Rodriguez. Francisco Huerta. Mia Munoz. Jimmy Mendoza. Charlene Lynn Gonzalez. Michaela Mori. Oscar Alvarado. Zachary Dean. Krista Velardez. Aurora Sensarong. Taj Lakes. Tyler Ruiz. Samuel Russell. Laviaka Rose Mendoza. Keely Embriani. Taj Alia Edwards. Sierra Harris. Bryce Miller. Dimitri Taylor. Ryan Oconma. Reese Oconma. Stephen McGee. Christian Navarrete. Johnny Cabarubias. Marina Quiroz Vega. Paulina Rodriguez. Vincent Zamora. Jonathan Davis. Matthew Ramirez. Brianna Alvarez. Samantha Monje. Michelle Garcia Gonzalez. Ethan Etheridge. Terrell Jackson. Maya Del Pay. Kendall Marin Allen. Imani Bellamy. Kiana Griffin. Jaden Reynolds. Tawan Terrell. Luis Avila. Carlos Garcia. Alex Estrada. Peter Mejia. Summer Tucker. Liana Avina. Jacob Romo Brady. Noah Rodriguez. Carolina Seja Gomez. Fatima Mora Popoca. Caitlin 
Alan Macias. Miranda Camarena. Araceli Trujillo. Paige Mosqueda Harris. Genesis Fernandez. Benedict Mario. Steven Toscawa Ramirez. Ian Wynn. Mia Ramirez. Isaac Sevilla. <laughs> Leslie Hernandez. Paula Munoz. Joshua Vasquez. Guillermo Campos Cervantes. Oscar Lozada Vicencio. Dalia Delgado. Victoria Ocampo Robles. Diego Castillo. Ricardo Yanez. Rafael Sanchez. Dylan Lewis. Mia Castillo. Jacob Reynel. Garrett Bougie. Ty Thomas. Angelina Dillard. Zachary Thomas. Noah Martinez. Anthony Lara. James Mejia. Devin Mendez. Fabian Garcia. Brandon Vega. Dennis Evans. Alexis Luna. Melissa Garcia. Isaac Romero. Daylin Allen. Jesus Naranjo. Claudia Figueroa. Chloe Dotran. Zoe Villanueva. Elena Gaitan. Ayana Huerta. Alanis Herrera. Michael Connolly. Tomás Beo Canto. Patricio Flores Lara. Daniel Doe. Jordan Ariola. Joshua Ariola. Legacy Apodaca. Zion Smith. Jenna Diegas. Isaac Williams. Yeah. Julian Paz. Yeah. Alfonso Martinez. Yeah. Josh Effort. Yeah. Skyler Ayala. Yeah. Alexander Tecun. 
Alexander Aquino. Abdullah Nadvi. Nathan Lint. Jaden Robinson. Damaya Allen. Marcus Owens. Casmir Malone. Esperanza Herrera. Brooke Lyons. Isaac Abraham. Shiraz Ahmad. Jose Alfredo Larios. Randy Martinez Uscanga. <laughs> Luis de la Cruz Mirel. <laughs> Daisy Lopez. <laughs> Linda Ovetta. Crystal Ramos Hernandez. Matthew Lopez. Abigail Kush. Giovanni Tejeda. Juan Castaneda. Annette Mercado. Mackenzie Gardner. Otero Dylan. Um, Dylan Otero. Daniel Teyes Hernandez. Justin Prince. Sage Larios. Alejandro Garcia. Hanna Lopez. Carissa Arias. Mohamed Arali. Frankie Maestas. Fernando Navarrete. Arlette Reyes. Evan Thompson. Dylan Most. Paul Juarez. Isaiah Castro. Leonardo Barajas Valdivia. Jacob Briggs. Armando Gomez. Max Magana. Destiny Alvarez. Julian Arroyo. Jaslyn Mercado. Yadira Garcia. Mauricio Sandoval. Milo Gonzalez. Alan Jones. Ethan Gates. Chelsea Provencher. Ariana Sparrow. Devin Bolden. Deshay Brown. Ayana Burris. Yair Baragan. Mario Hernandez Margarito. Alexander Washington. 
Amaya Amir Kanti. Uzoti Unge. Patrice Baxter. Cesar Solis. Isaiah Martinez. Christopher Salcedo Blanco. Carissa Ramirez. Moises Ruando Sanoval. Joshua Mena. Xavier Nunez. Peyton Murray. Mia Nepomuceno Sanchez. Brooklyn Scott. Sonia Garcia Henry. Kira Falcons. Ashley Maldonado. Giselle Champa Panet. Ariana Lopez. Gianna Cardona. Denancy Gamba. Anthony Santos. Devin DeCastro. Melvin Velasco. Julian Powell. Madison Abrego. Trinity Gonzalez. Aoki Dyson. Madison Orantes. Ariana Gutierrez de Aragon. Kylie Torres. Gabrielle Garibaldi. Andrew Ibarra. Damien Contreras. Leilani Guillen. <laughs> Isabel Jaramillo. Frank Zavala. Riley Garrett. Giovanna Angelica Rodriguez. Kayla Rodriguez. Niobe Martinez. Fabian Moreno. Bernardo Carrasco. Mylene Espinosa Medel. Alondra Castillo. Zulmadali Gonzalez Escobedo. Kevin Alvarez. Osvaldo Ramos Nunez. What? Raymond Miranda. <laughs> Natalie Medina. Alia Tejera. Priscilla Alvarez. Tyler Wall. Yelena Alvarez. Adrian Seely. Jalissa Ruiz Moore. 
Michael Raymond Salazar. Lillian Sammy Sayeth. Jessica Osuna Santian. Anthony Duran. Leslie Alonzo. Abriana Esquiano. Taylor Keniston. Trap fought. Carlos Veliz. Ryder Libby. Furman Fuerte. Lamaya Coleman. Nakela and Jocelyn Cecina. Angelina Perez Orozco. Mariah Martinez. Melissa Menjibar. Maripet Lopez. Nicole Magana Valencia. Moses Salaya. Karam Worthy. Eliezer Rocha Rodriguez. Isaiah Alarcon. Gavin Gutierrez. Stefan Cook. Yeah. Eduardo Mejia. Andrew Perez Anguiano. D'Angelo Dixon. Marcus Parker. Brianna Reyes. Michael Fuentes. Yaratsi Nava. Arlet Ruiz Urutia. Leslie Lisette Velasquez. Angie Lisette Oropesa Martinez. <laughs> Charlene Solano. Priscila Alzaga. Gael Becerra. Hegel Quesada. Adrian Gonzalez Ramirez III. Savannah Joe Estrada. Emily Perez. Daniel Rodas. Carlos Chaydez. Angel Zamora. Lucio Huerta. Edwin Campa Sanchez. Angel Rodriguez. <laughs> it's El Espejel. <laughs> Liana Mayorquino. Jenna Valladares. 
Genesis Linda Rubio. Ramiro Ramirez. Bianca Luna. Crystal Sabrina Summer Mendoza. Justice Alyssa Delgado. Noah Cordero. Eileen Chavez. Jason Munoz. Andrew Cesena. Samantha Lopez. Daniela Jaime Apollonio. Isaiah Maldonado. Homer Flores. Jason Bocci. Isaiah McGee. Caleb Espinosa. Isaac Sierra. Raymond Olguin. <laughs> Isaiah Ward. Cameron Grigsby. <laughs> Samaje McGlory. <laughs> Andrew Baldonado. Tania Johnson. Ashley Sevilla. Damarian Cowboy Nation Harris. Kendall Riddick Brown. Alyssa. Estrada Padilla. India Russell. Victoria Rosales. Devaney Langston. Juan Mota. Raymond Boride. Adair Mendez, Brandon Perez, Gael Soto del Rio, Roberto Campos, Harvey Orozco. Sabrina Arevalo. Miguel Moreno Guerrero. Samantha Rios. Maria Fuentes Melara. Álvaro Espinosa Núñez. Alexa and Alexis Pisiano Herrera. Francine Ariola. Jacob Mendiola. Jimena Torres. Jacqueline Fuentes! Nadalyn Lara! Angelina Sarate Avila! Alana Harper! Melody Gonzalez! 
Giselle Rodriguez. Daisy Medina. Sophia Aquino. Natalie Moreno. Fatima Andalon. Alejandra Rubio. <laughs> Melissa Tice. Blaine Anderson. Jacob Bora. Adriana Guzman Garcia. Cyan Garten. <laughs> Eliana Portillo. Clarissa Larabacchio. <laughs> Chloe Glein. Mia Cancino. <laughs> Alyssa Obando. Ivan Martinez. Diego Jefferson. <laughs> Anthony Esquivel. Evan Haskamp. Mercedes Alba. Luis Garcia. Erwin Ruiz. Alexandro Bernal. Jezebel Kia. Henry Trujillo. Liam Dan Mulligan. Jocelyn Colorado. Adrian Delgado. Destiny Cabrera. Emily Neri. <laughs> Elijah Amasqua. Joaquin Avon Sosa. Paul Mejia. Zachary Coltenbaugh. Yeah. Brian Lopez. Yeah. Jessica Corona Velasquez. <laughs> Gabriel Cooley. Yeah. Leslie Elizabeth Salgado. Osvaldo Villalobos. Carlos Saldana. Sebastian Camargo. Jade Galvan Muñoz. Michelle Ojeda Lopez. Jonathan Cabrera. Amelia Soto. Adriana Araceli Manzanares. Juan Daniel Gomez Cortez. John Iscoto. Jose Madueño. Ava Valdez. Leilani birthday girl, Ray Loba. Jennifer Flores Guerra. Andrea Negri. 
Rebecca Rivera, Marisol Pelayo Hernandez, Viviani Chan, Denise Velasquez. Julia Acevedo. Shelby Perez Harrison. Ellen Barajas. Jan Sarabia. Marlene Colato. Isabella Rodriguez Ramirez. Daisy Delgado. Daisy Cabrales. Karima Osegueda. Jennifer Sanchez. Saraid Lopez. Kiara Anderson. Mary Grace Gurola. Priscilla Brianna Vitella. Valerie Salmon Santos. Daisy Martinez. Janine Perez Guerrero. Soraya Conaway. Ishan Chen. Dominic Shallow. Mia Aguila. Aiden Mendoza. Luis Ramirez. Jeremiah Alexander Ortiz. Austin Price. Adam Holland. Rasan Sergis, Marina Mendieta, Roslyn McDonald, Adriana Sanchez. Verónica Aguilar Cifuentes. Ariadne Pineda Acevedo. Kevin Salis. Andrea Rodriguez Rojas. Luis Xavier Diaz. Kirsten Keeney. Daniel Reyes. Ian Mozzi. Stephen Sheehy. Giselle Tapia. Jalissa Tapia. Brooklyn Small. Elsie West. Morel Baru. Mejd Batarse. 
Jacob Franco. Alina Franco. Andrea Bradley. Nathan Gagnon. Jacob Reed. Valeria Hernandez. Victoria Garcia. Grecia Castellón. Jerson Penuelas Cordero. Alyssa Martinez. Catherine Abrego. Julian Centeno. Carmen Pook. Sierra Christensen. Christina Benjamin. Heidi Garcia Gonzalez. Gianni Espinosa. Diana Garcia. Bianna Birmingham. Ryan Asher. Alex Saron Mendoza. Anthony Gurriel. Ivan Gomez. Anthony Linares. Greco Cortez Aceves. Rebecca Magana. Christopher Higuera. Natalie Hurtado Ordaz. Andrea Rosales. Maria Martinez Hernandez. Alexia Cruz Gonzalez. Caleb Morales. Rosalind. Garcia. Luis Garcia Garcia. Diego Cesena Cesena. Litsi Salazar. Melina Bravo. Brian Osuna. Celeste Centeno Arriola. Gonzalo Lopez Muñiz. Nico Gutierrez. Kylie Hagstrom. Jackson Sellers. Aaron Ewell, Zachariah Rodriguez, Amanda Lynch, Abriana Martin, Adeline Arellano Madrigal. Vanessa Marcela Hernandez. Ethan Kai Chow. Started on the right, we're going to turn it to the left. 
<laughs> if we could direct our attention to the center podium for one final announcement. Graduates, now is the time for the symbolic ritual called turning of the tassels. Graduates, please stand. Turn your tassel from right to the left. You are now official graduates. Congratulations, class of 2023. Again, graduates, please make your way out to your left where you guys came through, through the left. Parents, you may meet with them in the parking area. Congratulations. Thank you. 